A thorough investigation is certainly recommendable if the truth has to be known regarding how approvals were made for a named investor to put up structures in the middle of Lusaka Water and Sewerage Company boreholes that service water to the residents of George Compound in Matero constituency. As can be evidently seen, one of the boreholes is already being covered in the construction taking place. The Lusaka City Council says it has not approved the construction taking place here, but that proposals for the said buildings to be put up have been made to the council. Council Acting Public Relations Manager Mulunda Habenzu says the council will conduct investigations to determine as to how the named investor went ahead to construct the structures without council approval. Well, I think from our side we cannot confirm really whether there are pipes that are, you know, under there, but uh, we sent our planners to, to investigate on the matter. And basically the information that we have is that um, the developers, they have the title, which was um, uh, you know, given by the Ministry of Lands. And uh, this month they submitted the plans to Saka City Council, which have not yet been approved. So we're trying to get a layout map. Uh, in short, we want to do more investigations um, uh, arising from the fact that there is an alleged uh, you know, issue of the pipes uh, on the ground. So for us to be able to give a concrete uh, response as to whether indeed there are pipes there, we need to get uh, that information. So basically, um, this is the tentative information that we have, that uh, the, the developer has a title and they have submitted plans to us. But of course, before we go ahead with the, with, with the approval of the plans, we need to get those facts on the ground. Matera Member of Parliament, Mao Sampa, has declared that the construction taking place here is illegal. Serious uh, uh, anomaly and shortcoming. Uh, Matero in, in particular has had problems with water. Uh, so we've had to f find uh, water sources in some bores away slightly from the residents. Uh, now where we've got these pumps, uh, we are told somebody is building a warehouse there. A, we don't know how he was given the title deed to start building where there are, there are water pipes. Uh, so somebody is being selfish there and building and jeopardizing uh, over 200,000 people's welfare in terms of water sources. Uh, so we we'll move in and ask the person building there to avail us the title deeds so we can see who gave him the title deeds there. And if he doesn't have proper documentation, indeed we will engage the council to see if the warehouse can be demolished. One thing clear is that the Ministry of Lands has issued a title deed to this investor building here, but that has been done without consideration of the water pipes lying down here. Any damage caused to the said infrastructure will affect the more than 200,000 residents of George Compound who are beneficiaries of the water supplied through these boreholes into their residence. Mwapek Mwenda, Movie TV News, Lusaka.